This video is about the undiscovered mountain top view for Cebu Island. I'm here right now in Kandulan, Minglanilia, Cebu, and this is an undiscovered place where you can see a beautiful view of the city of Cebu and as well as the other cities of Cebu like Talisay. And this is located here in Minglanilia, Barangay, Kandulao. Otherwise, this is known as the Gulias Heights. For people who likes their selfies, you know, the tops in Busay has already closed down for renovation. Although this one is an actual chapel that's not been repaired yet after Odette, but it's still open to the public and you still can see the magnificent view here in Gulias Heights. This is located in Barangay Candulao, Minglanilia, and I want to show you the view that this place, this chapel will give you. And you can see how beautiful it is. It's right on the road when you drive to the Gulias Drive, our very known political family here in Cebu, but he is known to be a true Cebuano helping the poor here in Cebu connected with the University of the Visayas our beloved Eduardo Gulias so this is the mountains here that you can see in Minglanilia and look at the view Although it's not maintained so well because like you can see the chapel has been destroyed by the typhoon Odette last December and no repair has been done yet. But you still can go around and look at the view of Cebu Island. There. This is going to the south of Cebu. This is around Naga and San Fernando. Because we are here in Minglanilia. So you go around the chapel, the view is becoming beautiful. Because now you can see the city of Cebu and the silhouette of the other islands like Matan. There used to be sitting areas here where you can take your selfies and there you are. The magnificent view of the city from the different angle. So there is Minglanilia, Talisay, then go to Cebu City, and it's not, imagine during a nice day you can see the proper view or the proper silhouette of houses within Mactan. I don't think this is Mactan. That's Bohol. Bohol Island. Because that's Mactan, I could see the bridge. So this is Bohol Island that you can see from Ming Lanilia Hills. There's nobody lives in the house in Gulia. That's the Gulia's house. That's the Gulia's mansion. But I don't think it's someone's living there because all the roof has not been repaired yet. Look. Maybe. That's the Gulia's mansion. This is just their amenities. I think this is their... Like there, there's basketball court. And oh, yeah. This is like the Besipur's Turba. That's their main the, house. Their guest house. So look at here. Behind the chapel, you can see a viewing deck. So you could imagine the people who can discover this Gulias Heights in Barangay Candulao, Minglanilia is a place to visit for selfie takers or you want to see a different view of Cebu. There, Cebu with the silhouette of 
island of Bohol. Now I discovered that there's a lot of houses living in the, I mean, houses erected in the mountains. Yep. And I think those are only people, rich people that can afford to have those kind of houses. Excuse me, can you I mean, uh, uh, that's, um, I think, no, this one, um, that's, I think that's the Alta Vista Heights. Which one? This one, the big houses that you see there. That's in Pardo. Ah, the Going, Alta that's Vista. Alta Vista. But Pardo can, I don't know if it can be viewed here. Because Pardo there, this is, we are in Minglanilia. So we go down. You can see how, uh, if this is well maintained, this is a good selfie spot. Uh, can be a tourist spot as well. Because it continues on there, this beautiful garden. It's not the right term, but it's not. It's unmaintained. It's unattended. It's, oh, unattended. Because there's a beautiful garden down there. And imagine the people will have a night trip here, overlooking the city. Yeah, the, view, the view is amazing. I tell you that. That's Mactan Island over there. You can see the bridge, the silhouette of the bridge. And this is more on the south side of the island. Is that the I don't know. Maybe a different one. Deca homes here in Manglanilia, Pakigni. Oh yeah. So there's you can see a lot of housing subdivision and how congested. Yeah. So the, you can see the south. There's Naga. Yeah, very visible from here, Naga City of Cebu, and then San Fernando, the San Fernando Church. So this is undiscovered area where you can have fresh air and the view of the city. Like I said, imagine this on a nice sunny day. It's very windy here despite the humidity of the rain and shine, rain and shine. Helicopter. Helicopter is just too small. <laughs> yeah. Look, this is beautiful. So anyone who wants to visit here, it's called the Gulias Heights. You can ask the people in Ming Lanilia, you know, where the guys Sano. Grand Mall of Ming Lanilia. This is right across, but you pass a little bit from Gaisano Ming Lanilia, and there's a road going up. That's where you follow that road right on the end, because you can see the yellow building of Gaisano Ming Lanilia. You pass that a few meters from that, and then go on the right side of the road to go up here on the hills. And this is where it's located very beautiful you can see naga and if you got a proper binoculars it's amazing here proper binoculars will get you the pure view of what you want to look in the city if you are you have your proper binoculars but i'm just showing it to you I would like to show you around this edifice that I'm in. This is the chapel here in Gulias Heights, but it is overgrown. I can't get down because the thorns of the bonganbilia is blocking the way. Same here. So this is like akin a small chapel, like a temple. Because you can see the decorations that they have, the banisters, you know, like the balcony type overlooking the city. And then that is the chapel where mass is held. I know some of you have already heard about the Gulias Heights, but I know a lot still hasn't been here. Because I haven't seen this place in most Cebuano vlogs. So this is a new place to discover selfie people. This is in Minglanilia, Barangay, Kandulawan, and you will be looking at the different angle of Cebu Island view. You are on top of the hill, 
and you will be looking at a different face of the city overlooking here on top of the hill I know people even admire some of the resort that has a view of the city but look at this during nighttime it's beautiful let's go around the temple so I think this is a Catholic church because it's got Santo Nino on the altar so you go around the church and you will see the view So they got this Grecian type of Grecian styled statues, sitting areas on corners, and this is the mountain view. And still you can see the edifice is still extending here. There are little gardens that you can see. So it's quite a good place actually, but it's been abandoned and maintained. So this is the church or chapel. With a beautiful view. It's amazing. I mean mesmerizing here. I'll show you around the building. And you can see it needs to be developed again because this could be a good spot for occasions weddings so i'll show you in the chapel and then i'll show you the other places down there what are the facilities of the garden the chapel Uh, the locals call this Gullias Heights. So look and see the grandeur of the chapel. And it's been raining, so you can see it's flooded. They just block it up with the bench. But I could have a good look on the side. I don't want to enter because they block it off. But that's the statues that's been here. There's a big Santo Nino on the altar. So... It's quite a nice chapel, well built. You can see that it's built on solid ground on the hill, not on a landslide prone area. And there's a view of the mountain. Very quiet here, very nice. You can hear the birds and the, feel the breeze from the ocean. So nobody is watching here, that's the guard house. Then here is the additional garden space. And additional more spaces there. And the building itself, the structure, it's not destroyed it's only the roof the aesthetics which are the windows and there's a gate here that people can come here and hail their events in some other places here you can hear see these are dungs of carabaos there's a fountain Bougainvilleas is now overgrown. There's like a stage area for events. 
and continuing on there's another one on the side whoa so there's another one there and if we turn here go further so animals has been living here big dunks means they are carabals or horses oh look there's a faucet so like function areas so this is the one that's been blown by the Odette Typhoon Odette Wow So another area here Another like kitchen like area Oh my god This is what a waste but it needs to be developed again then you're it's taking you back to the garden area on the side there's the stairs going down then you go on the pathway then you can go down there so there so sen is there that's the one talking he got a call from manila regarding some incident a criminal incident that happened so he's giving instructions to his liaison officer to procure the necessary things documents that he need for to pursue the case of um, criminal case wow this is amazing here actually i've heard about this before I just ignore it because um that was before I opened up my channel. And now I'm around the area because I was talking to a former colleague of mine. And, and also that's what we visit here because he got some sort of things that he needs to uh, need some advice. So that's another, that's the toilet area under the stairs. Then you go out on this gate. And there will be another gate that I see on the side. Cool. This is... The lights has been knocked down. The lights on both sides of the gate. There's no one watching the place, so... Oh, I'm scared about, you know, people stripping off the stuff here. And this is another area. Although it's connected with the side there. But it's easier for me to access if I go this way. That's the toilets. And here, view. Oh my god, amazing this place is. But not maintained, not prepared. But the structural integrity, there's no cracks on the roads, there's no cracks on the cement. There's no cracks on the column. That means the structure is really good. It's only the aesthetic. So the owner of this one will not have a lot of major repairs. It will be the aesthetic repairs, roof, doors, windows. A beautiful view, ladies and gentlemen. People who likes going on adventure, Looking at places like this, you need to visit the Gulias Heights here in Minglanilia, Cebu. So I will have a last look of the view here. This is like 
I can the same level as top Cebu very nice view here you should visit so that's Naga City Cebu that you can see and the amazing one here on the back of the chapel that's where you can see amazing views this overgrown tree needs to be trimmed a lot needs to be trimmed this is just abandoned but i believe this is owned by the gullias family and it is beautiful so while you are now paying 100 pesos just to take pictures in temple of leia try visiting here in Gulias Heights, Kandula, Minglanilia, it's free and you will see a different side of the view of the city overlooking Bohol Island. <laughs>